Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy MTG back here with another video today and today guys I'm gonna be going over how you guys can make millions and millions of coins currently in Madden 25 Ultimate Team If you guys do enjoy the video, I appreciate each and every one of you guys like subscribe Comment down below and turn on post notifications and without further ado, let's hop right into it So let's talk about how you can be making your coins right now in Mutt um, Obviously the first thing I say it's the beginning of every single episode I tried to do one of these pack um, these coin making methods stay away from the store guys the store is your worst enemy you are not in the long term going to profit most likely off the store so unless you're buying stuff stay away mystery pack it's fun to open it's fun to have some fun we gotta realize you're probably gonna lose so if you're okay with losing open it up have fun but if you're not okay with losing don't try it it's not a method there's no training rule that is a method in this game nothing you can do in this store besides maybe this where you get free stuff unless it's free you're gonna lose most likely so Steer clear packs. Don't even do it in the first place. Just not worth it. Not worth it. Now let's talk about some actual sustainable coin making methods. So I always start with this one just to tell you guys if you guys don't have a ton of coins, this is what you should be doing. And as of course the base team item set, you can complete this set for a right around a thousand coins, guys. It is so inexpensive. It is a great method to get you started off. And what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna be picking playbooks so that's what i pick because they sell the fastest you're going to pick playbooks and you're going to sell those cards off and you're going to make some coins off it's so like i said it costs about a thousand coins give or take to do this it might cost a little bit less a little bit more it's not it's not it's very very cheap guys it is very cheap to do this method you guys can see we'll pick a random playbook the only one i know that doesn't go for anything is the chiefs so pick any other team besides the Chiefs. I think most of them will sell for around 3,000 at least. You guys can see about 3,400 on this one. We're going to sell it off. We're going to make a little bit of profit right here. And we're going to make ourselves right around 2,000 coins. So this is a great method to do if you're very, very low on coins, guys. 100% recommend doing it. Super cheap. Super easy as well. So 100% recommend that. Now let's talk about some sets that can make you guys some coins. The first one we're going to talk about, again, it doesn't cost a ton to do this. The Team Builders Division Hero Fantasy Pack. Um, what you're basically doing is you're getting 82 overall cards. This set's going to cost you right around 30k right now, give or take. And we'll look at the prices of some of these cards. Some of them are right around what, you know, it costs to build the set. And some of them are a little bit more expensive. Darnell Wright, for example, 40k right here. 41k for... Divine Diablo right there, Jack Campbell's 40k. Urza Cleveland is almost 42k. So you're going to make approximately 10,000 coins every time you do the set. And like I said, it's super quick and super easy to do. I'm going to show you guys quickly what you're going to do. You're going to get 380s and you're going to get yourself, uh, I believe it's 178. So we're going to go to 80 to 81. I'd probably look at game time right now because it's a new promo. Uh, there's a lot of cheaper cards. You guys can see those are right around 10k. Filter down a little bit, you will see them for right around 9,000 coins. Um, so we'll just filter down. Obviously, there's a ton of these influencing the market. So again, you're looking for them for right around 9,000 coins, 9,500 right here. And what you're going to simply do is then you're just going to get a 75 or a 78 to 79 card, which are also very inexpensive. Just filter down by positions. You'll be able to find those. That is a great, great method to look into doing. If you guys want to earn yourself some cheap and quick coins, it's very, not cheap, I should say, but, you know, very quick coins. 10,000 coins might not seem like a lot, but you do that 10 times. You got yourself an 85 overall in your squad. So doing that is not a bad little method. Next method we're going to look at. So we're going to look at some AKA players. Now, these aren't as hot right now because there isn't a ton on the market. Um, but completing these sets, if you can get these cards for right around 90K a pop, you're looking at about 450,000 coins to complete this set. And all you simply need to do is you need to go over to the catalog. We'll look over here at the catalog. And you guys can see, if we go down here to the AKA promo, it's going to show us all the prices of these top guys. So you have Beast Mode, 600K. Now that's his vintage champion, so you're not going to be able to get that. But it's going to cost you 525 to complete Beast Mode. So that's a profit right there. And Paul Krause is the big one at 575,000 coins, guys. I mean, you're going to profit right around 75K if you get all those cards for uh, 90K. Now, obviously, they're not going to be popping up every second. But if you just check out throughout the day, look, there will be some that do pop up for that price. Uh, there was one before I started filming this video. I must have got bought up. 
just pay attention to it. Now, the Paul Krause one, the 83 itself, might go for a little bit more, might be a little more difficult to find. Uh, but the way you can combat that is if you simply complete this set right here, you're going to need uh, 878 overalls or 79 overalls. Uh, you can complete that for about 100K so you can avoid the Paul Krause trying to snipe it. So basically, you're going to spend right around 460K. Sell the card for 570K. You do the math. That's a nice profit right there. Definitely recommend doing that. Uh, the AKs are a good one to do. Other ones you could be doing right now, you could be doing the Season of Boom because there are uh, some 86 overalls that will make you some profit out of it, so we'll simply filter down. Like I said, look for these disparities in these sets. This is where you make coins, guys. It's not fun, but it's efficient. It makes you coins. You're not gambling away coins. It's not like, hey, let, let me spend 100K on mystery packs and maybe I hit a LTD. Chances are it's not going to happen. So 350k for either ETN or Trevon Diggs. And we're looking at what it costs to complete the set right now. So you're going to need five of these cards. Um, they're influenced. There's only 14 on the market right now. You'll get them for about 40k. So that's about 200k right there. We'll call it. And now these other ones right here, if we head down to, uh, we'll go to game time once again. That's where we could find them. 27k. You can get it for about 25k a pop. 25k times 375k plus 200k, 275 Quick math, sell it off. You're gonna make yourself about thirty thousand, forty thousand coins right there. That's a nice profit right there, guys. That is a hundred percent some nice profit right there. So hundred percent recommend doing that if you guys want to do the season of boom. And the final one we're gonna talk about, and this will be very efficient tomorrow with new legends dropping. You guessed it. I just leaked it. It is Legends right here. Legends, um, right now Larry Allen is the only profitable 86 overall one to do. So you guys see the 83s. Um, you're looking for about 60k a pop. Sell that car for about 350. You're only gonna make 15k on it, so maybe not the most efficient way to use your time. But it is there. It is there for you to make some coins if you want to do it. And the other one, uh, Larry Little, we're looking at for 82 overalls. This one is a lot better to do. You're gonna get these cars for about 50k a pop. Times that by five, the cars gonna sell for about 300k post tax. You're looking to complete that this set right around, give or take, 250k make 50,000 coins off it guys. I'm telling you, cheap, or not cheap, I keep saying cheap, fast ways to make coins guys. Save your coins, make your coins this way. These are the ways to make coins. Um, some other things I've been doing too, which I've been enjoying is I've been playing head to head ranked and that's been giving me some nice rewards as well. Obviously just up, updating my uh, pass. But you guys can see I'm doing pretty well and I'm not necessarily a good player. I don't have a crazy God squad. I mean, in the last, what, what would that be? Eight games, I'm seven and one. You'll get yourself some nice rewards. You guys can see right here, actually, if we head over to, once you start getting up here, 20,000, 20,000. I mean, right there is, what, 60,000. If you complete gold, then you're looking at right around 100,000. If you complete elite, getting to hero, I mean, that's another almost 150K champion. You're looking at 200K plus. Then if you somehow get yourself to the top 100, man, number one, you get an auctionable at a read, which is going to be a crazy, crazy card. Um, I wonder if we can see right here. Yep. So you guys can see you're also going to be earning rewards, not to mention tons and tons of coins. So recommend doing this as well. So if you guys enjoyed this little coin making method video, I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, comment down below, turn on post notifications, and I'm NTG. Peace out.